Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. So we are back with another reveal for the um, die cut swap over on my page at Coffee Cake and Crafting. This um, was a die cut swap that you had to have 15 cuts of several different dies. Um, you didn't have to have 15 dies, but you couldn't have any more than I think three cuts of each. Um, so I wanted people to use their die cuts, their cutting machines, and what punches and whatnot. Um, so I did group one, and now we're going to do group eight. We are out of order, but um, I kind of just left them in order that I received. So first up in this group is Heather Hanny. Um, this is how hers come packaged. And let me just ensure that they are not... Okay, so they are personalized. I guess I should have just flipped it over. I'm going to keep it in the um, bubble wrap so the presentation, they can get the same effect that I did. So Heather made one for me. Thank you so much. And as usual, uh, making one for the hostess is not required in my swap, so it's greatly appreciated. Um, so let's get into it. Oh, that's really cute. So she has everyone in kind of like a watercolor paper um, a cute little fabric rose, um, a paper rose, and some bling, and a wooden um, leaf. That's great use of texture. And she has everything in these in this tiny, tiniest little clips. I love these little clips. And she altered the bag. Um, that's her information there. And again, um, I'm going out of order with the groups, so it is what it is. Okay. Oh, that's so sweet. All right. Okay, so this is so cute. So she made a little photo book so you can put your die cuts in there. Made with Love by Heather Hanny. Oh, I like that stamp. And she has a little card in the back. Oh, sweet. So she gifted some die cut, uh, some um, cut aparts. Let life surprise you. Doubt your doubt. I love you. I love you. I love you. Oh, those are cute. So paper collection she used was um, Prima Rose or Prima Rose Court. I like this paper. And the photo book is from um, this is one of the ones to make a date over and scrap the world. She says here. I love these photo books. I made a couple of these from Tamika's tutorial. Okay, so you can totally use this. What a great idea! Oh wow, this is so cute. Great idea. Okay, so we have the Bird Swirl Doily Lace by Jamie. So this one, I'm not going to read these because you guys will get them. Um, and if you weren't in the swap, I'll just leave, kind of leave the paper there so you can kind of see what they were. Um, so it looks like she has a lot of them from the Silhouette store. She has some Jaded Blossom. She has Silhouette, Jaded Blossom. Heart Border from Simon Says, uh, Feather Set by Emily Stuckey in Silhouette Store, The Butterflies are Tim Holtz, The Doodle Rose is Silhouette, The Tattered Florals, Tim Holtz, The Leaf is a Fisker's Punch, and The Roses are um, Two Spring Roses by Nick Swirl, Silhouette Store. Okay, so that's all of that. But here they are. I'm not going to take the book apart, but you can see. I think this is my favorite. You guys know how I love some birds. And then we have like the rose background. She gave a couple of those. Those are super nice to put on cards. A big rose cutout. So she did it in white so you can um, choose whatever color you want. Um, sorry. Oh, fun. She gave some bag toppers. So here's the bag topper and you can switch out the paper. So she did the answer. That's a great idea. She gave you two of those, and the papers are double-sided, so you can always choose. Actually, I think this one matches better with this one, and then this one with this one. It doesn't matter. And then she gave a super thick, I wonder if this is watercolor paper on the tag. And then a couple of stitched hearts with that watercolor paper. So cute. And then she gave feathers, butterflies, and hearts, my three favorite things. So here's like the little heart banners. That's a cute die. 
and then she has the punch are these feathers but oh, so yeah these are um, Tim Holtz I thought they were gonna be the cameo so she has the when they're together they look like this so you can ink up the top and leave the back white if you wanted to it looks like this may be some watercolor paper as well so you can definitely use your watercolors these are cute so she punched out some feathers on like this um, desert sand type color I love feathers that's why this is one of my favorite paper collections. And then she gifted a bunch of the roses in pink and white. And then these are the tattered flowers. So if you've never um, seen these, you put them together and it makes like a bigger flower. Or you can use them separately. And she gave you a set in the darker color and the lighter color so cute so I don't know why I decided to do this die cut swap because now it's like oh I need that die cut I want that I want this but with that if I ever need one or two you know just a cut off one off I can just call you guys and say hey somebody send me this <laughs> so joy of being a hostess okay oh wait I mixed that's okay I'll put them on back later I do go back and put them back and then I use them accordingly because I like to know. I try to give credit where credit's due when I um, use stuff people have sent me. I mean, I'm not the greatest with it, but I try. Okay. And then that says choose kindness. This is one of my favorite. And there's that. So thank you so much, Heather. So her photo book was her um, handmade element um, as the goodie, but she did some texture on here. She has a wood, an altered wood rose, those two um, feathers with some shimmer, a cute doily, and she has like texture paste on here so it feels like real, real wood. I would have never thought to do that, but that's like my mind is like, can't wrap my head around like it feels like real wood, but I know it's paper. <laughs> So that is so cute. Thank you so much. I'm going to pause the video and go to the next person. Okay, guys. So next is Maria Snook, who is Scrapbook Nut 2002 here on um, YouTube. Her Instagram is Maria Snook, and then she gives you her email address. Um, she has made... Um, two packages and the foil and blue and two with the um, cherries and pink. So it's like a little llama and a bear. So um, she made one for me. Thank you so much. They're all the same. Just um, I'm assuming just different paper on the outside. They look like they're all the same. So I'm going to go ahead and open the pink one because she said just pick whichever one I want. I don't think they were personalized. I didn't see anything on there. I only opened two of them because I saw the different papers. So if they are personalized, um, you guys won't know that I opened yours. So <laughs> I'll put it back. Let me move some of this out the way. So Maria is so sweet. Thank you so much for the card. I really appreciate you and your kind, kind words. And she also sent a cute little hostess gift. So I just want to share that with you guys. And if you were um, with me on my Sunday live chat, uh, we were talking about um, hostess perks um, that sometimes as a hostess you get extra gifts. Not only do you get extra swaps for yourself, but you get extra gifts. And so I was encouraging everyone to go ahead and swap. So this is a beautiful um, card that she made me. It's so cute. It says everything is better with a friend. And it's some butterflies and rhinestones. It's so cute. And then she gifted these bling pieces and again these are the hostess gifts so you guys don't have this um it's just a special perk of being a hostess and these cute little unicorn stickers i've never seen those before um and then also this really gorgeous pennant like i've never seen this it has um these cute little butterflies and bling and it opens from the top. I don't know if it's going to open while it's on the um, paper. Probably not. 
No, because it's like stuck in there. Um, so it's like a cute little pennant. You can put your little trinkets in there. I really like that. And then she also gifted these super cool um, like bling pieces, bling pieces, like some resin, some buttons, some bling. These are so cool. I've never seen them, but I'm assuming they come from Michaels because they're a rec rec Recollection brand. And then this, it looks like it's the jo dollar store, but how stinking cute is this? I cannot with how cute this is. I've never seen these. Um, so, you know, they may or may not have them at your dollar store. Oh, it's tape shut. So it has paper clips and binder clips and a little thing of tape and some um, paper flags and some sticky notes and some rubber bands. I am ex so excited for this. My favorite color is pink, one of my favorite colors. I would definitely be using this at work. This is so cute. Such a great gift idea. Um, thank you so much. And they all came in this really cute um, suede bag. So thank you so much, Maria. I really appreciate you doing that um, extra step in your, again, your, your kind words. I really, really, um, needed that right now. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. So let's get into her swap. And so she has a cherry die cut here out of gold foil. And I'm wondering if that's a cupcake paper. Um, I think so. And then she has her information with the cutest little bow with some, um, I don't know if this is glitter paper or she, put sparkles and then on the little um, journal tag she put the information here um, so sorry I'm just I just got to answer this really quick okay you know nobody wants you until you're busy and then they have an like so here's the back she just covered it with some pink and then let's see we can untie it I like to save everything if I can so we'll just go ahead and untie it from here and I don't know. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. And there's more good nights. <laughs> that is a ton of die cut goodness in here. Okay. So here's her list of everything I saw. Um, I saw some of this on her YouTube channel. I didn't want to watch the whole thing, but I did take a sneak peek. Not going to lie. So here's her cutting list. Now, again, don't fret if you forgot to put your cutting list. I'm the one who made up the rules. And honestly, I forgot my cutting list. So, <laughs> or my, um, list. So, um, yeah, it happens, you know, we're human. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. Okay. So first we have, um, oh, this is really pretty washi tape. Okay. Oh, and I think these are just goodies. Oh, cool. So we have some, I think she made these. I'm pretty sure. I think, did I see these on your page or did you message me? I think she might've messaged me these. But these are so cute. So she laminated a um, die cut, which you can use in your TNs. And then she used some epoxy stickers and some of the paper collection and made these super cute um, paper candy or card candy, I think they're called. So she has like a little rainbow and it shimmered. I don't know if you can see it. I'll try to catch it in the light. And then she did this little heart collage with the tiniest little flower. How cute is that? Can you? I don't know if you guys can see that because of all the glare. And then these cute little puppy, uh, I think they're puppy dogs. They're like kind of like a mix. Yeah, they're dogs. Um, with the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest little bow and a rhinestone and then some crowns with a rhinestone. Those are so cute. So they're like, you can even use them as flare. And she gifted some eyelash trim. I love eyelash trim. This is like a silver and iridescent blend and some white in there. And then she has gifted some of that twine. Um, so it's like a, a natural and a gold and then some gold thread. And then she has gifted some silver thread. That's awesome. I've never seen this silver thread. Let me fill it. Sorry guys. I'm a touchy feely person. So when it comes to crafting, let me clarify that for somebody calls the cops on me. So it's like super, super thin. Look at how thin that is. 
that's super fun. And it's like, it's like tinsel, like tea, uh, Christmas tree tinsel. That's how it feels. Okay, I will put that back in later. So that's your goodie pack. And then her die cuts. Let's do it. So she has gifted these, um, oh, they're rosettes. Hey, Kimmy, look at this um, flamingo washi. Kimmy, Kimmy Murray loves, um, I was going to say butterflies. Oh, my gosh. These are flamingos. Okay. So she gifted a ton of, oh, they're different. Hey, look at that. So those are flowers. This is a rosette like a small one and these are flowers and she did them in four different colors for you so pink purple a blue color and it's like super cool it's not a yellow and it's not a green um, her lighting on her camera was way better than mine so definitely check out her video and you can see the true color but I think these are like pop-up flowers yeah these are like pop-up these are super cool um, So it's, it's all silhouette, I bet. Yeah. Flat, oh, flat flowers. Flat flowers are Easel Cutting Art International and another store that, uh, you know, may or may not put us in YouTube jail. So we'll not say that name out loud. Y'all know that whole scandal. Scandalous. And then she... Um, gave a bunch of the flowers, the three petal flowers. I'm not going to take them out because they're going to go everywhere. But in the three matching colors, or four matching colors, um, so you can make your own 3D flowers using those. And then here are the leaves and um, and some more flowers, I think. Yeah. So there's a leaf and like a tulip type and then that, like a posy. So fun. Those are really cute. I just, I love this color. It's not highlighter yellow. It's like, I don't know how to describe it, but it's really pretty. And it just pops. It makes these colors just pop. Okay. So that's the first pack and then we have this little pack these are bows um, I think yeah bows and tags and these came from the um, silhouette and one came from um, a, you know a store in China so these are like the nestabilities kind of um, so she cut them out in all the sizes and then we have a gold bow and we have these bows that other gold bow is self-explanatory so we'll leave that in there I'm trying to go fast with these things guys um, and then we have these bows in different um, geez, Louise, different patterns these are so cute so you have that, and I think you can, if you want to like double layer it, you can if you wanted to. Those are so cute. Okay. So, okay, so we have those bows, and then we have, oopsies, I almost dropped it. Um, the bows in the front, which I think those are, um, from the silhouette store. Get in there. Um, so we have these bows um, in this shape here, in the traditional shape, and then like a triangle shape and some hearts that you can put in the center. Um, or you can use these as tails if you wanted to, honestly. Put that bow on top and use them as tails. So she cut them out in like the sprinkle paper, the cherry paper, um, 
Let's take these out. I've never seen this. Yeah. So you can definitely put like the heart um, on top of it, or you can leave it blank. Those are really cute. Okay, so that's that pack. And then um, we have, it's freezing in my house, and I don't know why. And usually I'm not cold. I don't know. In case y'all needed to know that tidbit of information, you know. Um, I'll put all that away later. So next we have this double layer bow on the shimmer texture paper. And we have some rolled flowers. So you have two different designs and they will be extra embossed because this is that embossed paper. So these are rolled flowers where you just take the end of it and you roll it up and it makes really cute flowers. Um, so you have like a scalloped edge, you have a squiggly edge, and it looks like there's one more in there. And then this one, again, so these will make bigger and smaller ones. Those are really cute. And she added the leaves in there and then the bottom pieces, it's just the circles. And then in this one, she had, these are rolled flowers as well. Um, they're just in the flower petal shape. So these give you different shapes when you roll them. So fun. I hand did some um, rolled flowers and I wish I just would have cut them from the cameo because um, they were a pain to hand do. But so there's that. Um, then we have this package, which has this really cool trim, like tassels and then some banners and a starburst. And she has, um, oh my gosh, those are my sticky, um, these things. I lost them and I just found them. They just stuck to my arm. Um, and then she has the paper clip to match. Um, so yes. Yeah. So in this one, she has the box. This is the, um, I don't know what these boxes are called. They're the popular ones. Um, I can't think right now, so I will show you. So when you put it together, you kind of just go, oh, come on. See, when you're on camera, nothing goes right. You put them, you know, you put them all together and they go in like that. So it's one of these boxes that looks like this when you're all said and done. Like that. I don't want to tear anything because I'm tired and I'm not um, focusing. That's what I get for doing videos at 11.30 at night and I know it's past my bedtime. <laughs> so then she has um, this box. So... I was trying to see the name of them, but one is, so the bottom one that I just showed you, that is the 3D box with handle. There's a gable box unicorn. There's a Heartland bow fry box and a 3D tie flat favorite box. And those are all from Silhouette Store. And then we have this box here. This is the box with the handle. So when you fold it all up, Well, you put the two pieces together and then when it's all said and done, what you're going to do is, um, um, sorry, I can't fold and talk. You put the edges inside the box like so. So imagine both sides all complete. <laughs> so this is one of those, I love these boxes. So she printed out in unicorn paper and llama. Save the drama for your llama paper. <laughs> I just love the llama paper. I'm hoarding it. So Anne-Marie bought me some of the llama paper, and I'm just, like, legit hoarding it. I need to use it, but I love it, and it makes me happy. So it's sitting on the desk. Okay, then we have a fry box. So you guys know what these are. So she printed that off in a couple of different pages. It looks like the McDonald's French fry box. And then this box here, ah, I think this is one of the ones that you have to use a ribbon to tie it close, hence the two holes. Um, oh, come on. 
So yeah, that's what this is. So it's like a little circle um, box like so. And then you, hold on, let's fold in these sides so you can see the whole box as a whole. So you pop it up and then you tie it shut with some ribbon or twine or something there. These boxes are so cute. I should think I just bought that um, cut file because they are great for swaps. And then we have another <laughs> pack. You guys definitely spoil with each other, I tell you. Um, so this one has a cute little bag topper that has the bow with the shimmer glitter paper, shimmer glitter paper um, with the texture cardstock here. And she made some, you can use these as buttons or page reinforcers or donuts. How about that? So she cut those out. Or like Brad reinforcer, you know, like the, so when you punch a hole, it gives it more stability. And she's gifted some boxes and um, some hardware to put with the boxes. So some pink breads, a flower bread, a star, some hearts. This is really cute. And we have, oh, cute. Um, these are like library pockets. But there's a Brad in the middle and a Brad at the top. I'm going to have to rewatch the video to see. Because she gave the brads. So let's see. It looks like it goes together like this. But it has a hole there and a hole here. Oh! <laughs> okay, I don't know why I'm so dense. It's a, um, a coin envelope. So you put the two brads so you can tie your string around and do like the S formation. Duh, Tiffany. So these are like the, the coin envelopes. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. Oh, why would they put the gold foil on the flamingos? Those are both my favorite pages out of this collection. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. And then she gave everyone the inserts to go along with it. <laughs> so that's what the holes are for, the, um, the donuts are for, is so you can put them on the um, the envelope and then put the brads through them. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. I'm gonna keep that in the video. So thank you so much, Maria, for playing. We greatly appreciate it. And um, on to the next person. Okay, next up we have Lillian. And she sent a hostess gift, so I don't think you guys have that. Um, so she sent hers in two packages, so that's why I knew I opened mine. Just coincidentally, I picked one and opened mine. But look at how cute she sent the little stickers on the packaging. It was really cute. My post office, everyone there really enjoyed it. But I'm going to actually keep these stickers, so I'm peeling mine off. I want it on my keyboard. Okay. So they're all packaged like this, and they have um, everyone's initial on a bottle cap. So I'm not going to take everyone's out. I'm going to leave those in that package, and we'll just look at this one. So, and let me move that. Okay. So she has gifted perfect timing for 4th of July. Look at this gorgeous scarf. I love these scarves. I used to get these all the time when I worked at AC Moore. It's so pretty and it's like super thin so you can use it um, during um, winter or summer. Oh, so cute. Sorry, I was reading her little card. It says family fun. Um, but yeah, that's so sweet of you. So she's, oh, she sent some sea salt caramel latte. Oh, caramel latte is my favorite. I never had sea salt, so you can make it hot or blend it. Oh, those are fun. I've never seen these. And she sent some barista espresso beans. Oh, I love chocolate covered espresso beans. I just bought some today at um, our what you call them? 
our local coffee shop thing. Thank you so much for these hostess parts. I appreciate it. Let me put those on my other table. Okay, so the swaps come packaged with your initial with the Scrabble tile in a bottle cap, which you can definitely use. A firework. Is that even a, can you say firework or is it fireworks? I don't know. Yeah, no, I just been making stuff up. Okay. So we have some fun stuff in the back. We're going to start from, I'm going to start front to back. So we have some shreddies. Oh, I love this little doily in the flower with this butterfly paper. So she made hers in a loaded envelope style. Oh, very cute. These are brads. Fun. Okay, so in this first one, we have um, some mason jars that she has altered already for you. Gorgeous. So this one's painted with, um, so they have like the two front tags. This is my I love the color yellow. Um, and then this one with the, uh, oh wait, what is that? It's like a gold, I don't know if that's embossed or what on the top of that one. And then a green one. And they have like little embossings. You can't see it because my lighting's horrible. And then a Tinkerbell or a fairy. All fairies to me are Tinkerbell. <laughs> These are so cute and they're ready to go. Like you just have to sign your name and there you go. You can put it right on your package. I love ready to go. Okay. And then next. Oh man, I think I'm going to be a sucker for these. You guys know I love anything patriotic. Look at how cute these are. The little picture frames. And she did one in like a um, patriotic theme. And then this one. And then she did two just not regular for you. So you can put your picture on the inside or you can just leave it as is like this. These are so cute. So a lot of hers were um, Cricut cartridges, um, Tim Holtz, and We Are Memory Keepers. Okay. Next we have... Oh, these are adorable. It says memories with the bling camera. Those are super cute. These are fun. You could do cards. You can do scrapbook layouts, anything. Sorry, I'm yawning. And, you know, right. anyway, some shreddies. And then she gifted a pen. I love these pens. And bring it to work and a super fun um, wand oh it's supposed to go like this so you have the the ribbon tails huh, I love ribbon tails actually I'm gonna put that on my desk I mean my son's gonna love this um, so we have dog tags how fun. I love little dog tags with like little torches. So we have, she gifted some white ones. So, and then this is Liberty Parade. That's so cute. And then she gifted some star brads so you can make it your own and one little heart. And it's like just the dog tags with a torch. So there are these, so she printed out USA in blue, red and pattern paper. Probably should just leave everything in the packages, but these are so fun. So you can layer it how you want. Hey, get off there. Those are really cute. Like so. And then she cut out Murica here. Oh, wait, look at this. Wait, wait, wait. Wait till you see this. Oh man, I know I'm gonna have to give this to my son. Look, it's ay, ay, ay. it's the flag. Merk with the flag. That is so cute. 
and then she just cut out some more red, um, red and blue silhouettes so you can put it behind the white. Super fun. You should see my son's room. He has like, it's all, it's 100% patriotic. And then he has like every branch of the military, something representing every branch up there. So cute. You know, you expect a 16 year old to have like inappropriate stuff, but he's so patriotic that all of his stuff is patriotic. And I'm sure he has, and he has like his favorite girl posters. Mm, you know. Okay. So next we have looks like a globe. Um a telephone, a typewriter, an old timey fan, a couple of them, I think, and a globe. Oh, that was super fun. So you can pop it out or you can leave it whole if you want. Yeah. Those are so cute. So thank you so much for playing, Lily, and thank you so much for making me one. And the hostess gifts are greatly appreciated. She did this in honor of my husband. So thank you for that. Thanks for supporting our troops. You guys are super amazing with that. Um, so much support and love for our troops. And, you know, we greatly appreciate it. Not that I'm a troop, but <laughs> I'm a wife. So I appreciate you supporting our, you know, um, our troops. Sorry, I couldn't talk and put that in there at the same time. Okay, and let me get our last one. I'll be right back. Okay, last but certainly not least, we have Dawn Nugent, and this is how hers come packaged. Um, she wrote me a cute little note. And um, she gave me some extra treats, and I'll show you guys the extra treats in a second. But they all come packaged pretty much the same. I'm going to leave them in the box because it's easier for me. And she made one for me. Thank you so much. And um, let me move this. This is how they come packaged. But first, I want to show you this super cute gift card holder. Thank you so much, Dawn. I really appreciate you. This is so cute. Look, it's a little belly band that comes off, and then the top flips up. And there's a special treat in there for me. And then look at this cup. <laughs> I cannot with how cute this is. And it says thank you. And she wrote a sweet little note on the other side. And she put a cupcake with some sprinkles and some bobbles. I like these things. This is cool. And then some taffy inside. These are really pretty colors. Like look at me. I'll just look at it and not eat it. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'm going to eat it. <laughs> Y'all know me and my candy. This is so cute. I want to take it to work, but I know my, my girls will want it. So I'm going to leave it at home. Thank you so much. That was really sweet of you. Okay. So this is how hers come back. Oh, this is so funny how two of you did the patriot, the patriotic theme. It's so fun. Okay. So we have this cute altered paper clip with some stars on it. And um, a bow on an altered paper clip, the little rhinestone. This looks like Wonder Woman. It reminds me of Wonder Woman. I love Wonder Woman. And then we have some um, pinwheel. Um, these aren't toothpicks, the little stick things. These are so fun, especially when you put them in cupcakes. It gives it like a wow factor. So you have two of those. And then. We have, so she wrote in there, it was supposed to be a loaded um, envelope, but then it didn't fit with the bags. <laughs> so, you know, we all, you have to adjust. Oh, fun. It's a paper clip. It wasn't attached. Oh, and this too, it's a um, paper clip banner. So, wow, you can use everything. That's really cool. Great way to um, incorporate your um, handmade goodies. And then... Okay, I don't want to. Oh, that's a fun idea. So this is covering a staple. I just thought it was washi tape until I was digging in it. 
super fun. Okay, so there we go. So you can definitely reuse this loaded envelope. I'm going to put it back together. I'll put it back together off camera as I'm still doing it. <laughs> okay, so bag one, birthday die cut is, um, you know, from that. <laughs> um, we have Cricut, we have Spellbinders. Um, and that. These are fun. I love this die. Oh my gosh, I just totally manhandled this bag and just ripped it to shreds. So you have happy birthday. Um, oh, cute. I like this paper. Um, you have it in blue sparkle and like this golden brown color. I know it looks yellow, but it's like a, it's not quite copper, but it's almost copper. Those are really cute. And then she has, um, ah, these were two different. So she did, she, one is just the circle, the circle die cut. So you can layer if you want to, but you don't have to. They, it wasn't a set. That's a good idea. And then she has the heart die cut. These are fun. So like all the hearts, I love you this much. And then all these little baby hearts with it. And then this, oh, I like these colors. Let's see what's in here. Oh man, it's already 1215. I got a little bit. I went to the movies tonight, so that's why I'm all late and wrong. Oh my gosh, these are so fun. Okay, let me move this stuff over so you can see what's going on here. There's like bow ties and mustache and glasses. <laughs> oh, these are so fun. Okay, so we have smile and I guess it's summer, but I don't know what it says. <laughs> remember, remember one time, um, a thing said like, thank you or something. And I thought it said something completely different, but this says, it says hipster. So one says summer, one says small, one says clue, clue. Oh my gosh. Cool. And then one says hipster. That oh that one says red. I like the red ones. And then we have the plaid bow tie. And look at these glasses. Oh my gosh, those are so funny. Glasses. I like them. I'm still trying to figure out what this is. Oh, it says summer. Okay. <laughs> I told you I gotta go to bed. I have to, get, but like on my table, it doesn't look like that. So, but when I picked it up, you can clearly see S M or S U M M E R. Oh my gosh, Tiffany, I cannot. So we have a cute little, another little like dog tag, some clouds. Oh my gosh, I should totally edit that out, but it's okay. I'm gonna leave it. And then we have a smaller cloud. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I cannot with myself. And we have some more little bow ties, another little dog tag, um, some more clouds. And look at these mustaches, that's funny. Mustaches, maybe. And then these kissy lips. Those are so cute. This is so fun. Now that I figured out, you know the word. <laughs> uh, some days with myself, I tell you. Okay, let me put these away so that way I don't get them lost. I don't lose them. Oh man. I think I'm beyond the tire point. I don't know my grammar. I don't know how to read. 
Right, right, right. Okay. So in her last package, we have some boxes. We have a 4x4 four four lace folding card and a heart box. Oh gosh, I'm just tearing these bags up and I like to reuse everything that I get. Okay. Oh fun, so you can use these like a little envelope if you want it to. Like so. Oh, these are super fun. They're so like dainty. Let me see if I can get this one. That one, I think she pre-folded for me because that one went right into shape. That's super fun. I like that. Or you can even, you know, put something behind it and glue it on top. And then this sparkly, it looks like she may have shimmer misted this. Um, it is the heart box that looks like this when you're done. And then when you clip it together, it makes a heart on top. I love these boxes. Obviously, when you have it glued down, it's perfect, but it's not glued. So super cute. Thank you so much for everything you did here. You guys make sure you check out everyone. Um, so Dawn is YouTube Dawn Nugent. And then we had, oh my gosh, I can't even remember. Um, we had Maria Snook, who is Scrap with Net 2002. We had Lillian. Um, and I don't think she has YouTube videos up. I'm trying to remember. She does not. Um, No. Oh my gosh, why am I hurting my brain? <laughs> um, so no, she does not have, oh, hold on guys. Sorry, sorry, my phone's ringing. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay, sorry, that was rude. <laughs> my son is out with his friends and it's midnight, so I just had to make sure. He was just calling to let me know they're almost home. But it scared me, you know, when your kid's calling you at midnight. But anyway, okay, so we had um, Don Nugent. We had Maria Snook. We had Lillian. Um, Lillian, I don't know how to say your last name. I'm not even going to attempt it. And then we had Heather Haney, who started us off. Um and shortly, Heather, I will be in around your neck of the woods. So maybe we can get up. Definitely, I will email you when I get around there. But thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure that you do check these ladies out. Um, if you go to my Facebook page, Coffee Cake and Crafting, I do have the files of all of our members' um, YouTube addresses, if they have them. So that way we can support each other. And thanks, guys, for watching. Bye.